Welcome to my channel and thanks for joining me in this class. Let's start with our hands on the center, taking a deep breath in through the nose, filling our lungs with air. And when you exhale through the mouth, sense the pelvic floor muscles engaging in the stomach, drawing in, the navel lifting up. One more time, just like that. Inhale. Filling the lungs, exhaling all the stale air out, and really feeling the connection of the deep muscles of the pelvic floor and the stomach. Next time we inhale, we're gonna reach the arms up, clasp the fingertips, and stretch up. So again, pelvic floor muscles and stomach are connecting, lengthening the spine, it should feel like a Mm, good morning stretch. Let's stay there, shoulders down away from the ears. Drop the arms, chin to the chest, and rolling down one vertebra after another, softening the muscles of the face, softening the muscles of the neck. And let's just bend the right knee and the left knee, allowing your hips to move as much as they want. Just bend both knees, feel the feet pressing down, connecting into the floor, lift the stomach, slowly rolling up one vertebra after another, and again lengthening the spine, taking a breath in as the arms float up. This time hold on to your left hand with your right. So if someone else is pulling you up, so you're really opening the side, and let's take a stretch over to the right. Take your hips even further over to the left and coming back. Other side, so first lengthening up, opening the whole right side of the body, stretching over arms and head to the left. Take the hips a little bit more to the right. Open up even more and come back. Let's clasp the hands behind the back. Take the hands back as you open the chest, gaze up and then bending the knees, dive forwards, really relax the head, again bending the right knee and the left knee, allowing the arms to move as much as they want from side to side. Release the arms down, fingertips on the floor, bend the knees to gaze forwards, inhale, Exhale, drop the head down to the floor, reach the sits bones up towards the sky. Again, bend the knees, gaze forwards. Inhale, and stretch. Heels into the floor, hips up to the sky. One more time, bend, and stretch. Keep the right hand on the floor, bend the right knee as much as you want, and stretch the right sorry, the left hand up. Keep reaching up and then bend the elbow. Place a hand behind your back. Open the chest, look up to the sky. Other side, bending the left knee as much as you need. Left hand down, right arm floats up. Lengthen and then bend the elbow. Put the hand behind your back. Open the chest even more. Looking up, relax down, and rolling one vertebra after another, all the way up. Parallel feet, reach the arms up. Keep reaching up so much that you've got nowhere to go, so you have to go back, like taking a long arc back, and then open the arms to the side, dive forwards, Bend the knees, have the hands on the floor, take the legs back so you're in a pyramid shape. And walk the feet, any small movement that feels nice. And stay there, reach the heels down, reach the hips up, try and lengthen the arms as much as possible. Deep breath here, and gently place the knees on the mat. We're going to round the back like an angry cat. Really lift the stomach in. Keep lifting. 
and open the chest, gaze forwards. Just do that twice more, loosening up the back, rounding, lifting the stomach, bringing the top of the head towards the tail. And open the chest, gaze forward, slightly bending the elbows back. One last time, round, really lift the stomach as much as you can. And open the chest. And we're going to circle the ribs, creating big circles, allow the head to react, allow the hips to react. And let's go in the opposite direction. Notice how you're breathing as you do this. Keep breathing deeply in and out. Let's come back to center. Stretch both legs. Just gonna stay there, stabilizing the shoulders. Lift the center, long legs, and lift up to that pyramid shape. Let's come back. This time we'll twist both knees to the right and take the hips back towards the heels and forwards into the plank. And then to the other side, twist and back. Just one more time, either side, twist and back. Last one, twist and back. Lift your hips up. It's gonna take another moment to breathe into this stretch. They're gonna walk the feet towards the front of the mat holding on to each elbow with the opposite hand and dangling here, just rocking gently from side to side. And then bending the knees and we're gonna to come to lying on our backs. Rolling down one vertebra after another, after another. Arms pressing down into the mat. Now take a breath in and as we breathe out, contracting the pelvic floor, drawing the navel in, peeling the hips up just a little bit off the floor and dropping them down, releasing them down. Just take that small movement to really connect into the center. Peel the hips just a little bit off the floor and drop them down. One more, that very small movement and down. And next we're going to keep rolling. So start with that connection into the center, lift the hips up and then peeling up one vertebra after another. Take a breath in when you get to the top of the movement. And when you exhale, roll down one vertebra after another, all the way back down. Just do that one more time, rolling up one vertebra after another. This time we're going to stay there, press your feet into the floor to activate the back of your legs. Reach the fingertips up and stretch them back. Next exhale, rolling down one vertebra after another. And when the hips release into the floor, we're going to float our arms back. And we'll take that twice more. Rolling up, exhale. Arms reach up and over, inhale, rolling down, exhale. Inhale, float the arms back. Again, rolling up. Arms reach up, this time we're gonna stay there and the right side of the hips are gonna go down towards the floor and then lift up and then the left, so we're rotating the hips. So it could be a small movement or it could be all the way towards the floor. See how your back is feeling with this. One more time either side, down and up, down and up, stay up, press your feet into the floor, lift your hips up just a little bit more and roll down one vertebra after another back to a neutral pelvis, clasping the hands behind the head. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, draw the stomach in and come up. Going to stay there. Inhale to lengthen through the spine 
As you exhale, soften the chest as the stomach draws in. You're gonna stay there, inhale. Exhale, coming up just a little bit more. Make sure the hips still up, uh, relaxed and coming all the way back down. Again, inhale, lengthen. Exhale, coming up. Stay, inhale to lengthen. Exhale, softening the chest, drawing the stomach in, keeping the pelvis neutral. And float the right knee up and float it back down. And float the other leg up, left and down. Just one more time, either side. Right knee floats up and down as if the legs are really relaxed. This time I'm going to stay with the left leg up. Bring the right leg up. Lift the head and shoulders up just a bit more. And relax the head down. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, coming up. I'm going to stay here and roll the hips just a little bit off the floor and back down. So we're trying to do the work from the lower stomach and as little as possible effort for the, from the legs. Rolling up. Let's do twice more. Last one. Stay there. Try and bring the knees towards your forehead. Your forehead towards your knees. Relax the head down. Bend the knees. Inhale to create even more length through the spine. Exhale, lift the head and shoulders, lengthen the legs away. Inhale, relax the head down. Again, this time keep the head up, bring the knees towards the chest, lift the hips up and shoot the legs out. Twice more, just like that. And let's go into the crisscross. Bring the opposite shoulder towards the Bend knee. Let's go a little bit faster and a little bit faster and relax. Hug the knees and let's circle both knees in one direction. Getting a massage for the lower back and in the other direction. Lift the head up, walking ourselves up and down till we get to a sitting position. Stretch the legs forward, reach the arms up and over. So you can hold on to your feet or your uh, ankles or your thighs, wherever you, uh, wherever you can comfortably reach. And just stretch yourselves over. Rolling up. And we're going to take a roll down, or one vertebra after another. Reach the arms up and back and roll up. Inhale to come up and then exhale all the way forwards. Really stretch over your legs each time. And rolling down. Rolling up. One last time, rolling halfway and stay. Inhale as you exhale. Scoop the stomach in, roll down one more vertebra. Each time we're going to go down just a little bit more. And let's go all the way down. Bring the right knee towards the chest and stretch it up. We're going to hold on behind the leg. Inhale and exhale, lift the head and shoulders up. It's going to stay there, try and keep the same distance between the forehead and the knee as I take the head back to the floor. Opening the arms to the side, opening the legs, taking the leg across. So the right hip comes up a little bit and then circling it round. Leg circles cross and open. Three. Four, two more. Five. And six, circling in the other direction. So opening the leg to the right and then circling to the left. And two, three, four, two more, five, 
and six. Lengthen the right leg down to the floor. And bring the left leg in, stretch it up. Inhale as you exhale, lift the head up. Stay there, lengthening both legs, trying to keep the space in between the head and the knee as you take the head down. Open the arms, reach the leg over to the right and leave the stretch on the side of the leg and circling one and two, three, four, two more leg circles to this side and six, other side opening and circle, two, three, four, five, last one, six, and reach the leg down. Hold on to the legs again. We're going to bring ourselves into a ball and rolling up and down. Coming to a sitting position, opening the legs a little bit wider than the, than the mat and walking forwards. Let the head drop down, reach the sits bones back into the mat and lift the stomach. Just going to stay there for a moment. Coming up, opening the arms. Let's take a source. So first lengthen up, rotate the left hand, press the air back and we're going to reach the fingertips towards the little toe. I'm going to stay there. Think of both hips reaching down. Stomach goes back, really lengthening in between both arms and to the other side. So first rotating the right hand, pressing the air away, fingertips over the little toes, hips down. Stay there and breathe. It's taken a little bit faster and two pulses. Pulse, pulse, coming up. Pulse, pulse. And up, just one more time, either side. Pulse, pulse, reach up. Pulse, pulse, and up. Bend the knees, hold behind the calves. We're gonna go for an open leg rocker. So you can do it with slightly bent legs. You can try and straighten the legs, rolling back. Forwards, try and find the balance. Close the legs and open. And roll. <laughs> Coming up, close and open twice, small rock. Up, close, open, last one, rock. And up, close the legs. This time if you can, reach the arms out for a teaser. And then bend the knees and take them over your head. Let's take a roll over, flex the feet. Roll down, vertebra after another. Reach the legs forwards and close them twice. More just like that. Back, flex, open, rolling down one vertebra after another. Circle the legs, close them. One time. Just going to open the legs. If you can hold on to your feet, if not, you can hold on to your calves or anywhere else that's comfortable. And then this time we're just going to rock from side to side. Take a moment to stretch here. Let's come to lying on our side. I'm going to stretch the top leg away from us, so really lifting in the center. And slowly bring the leg forward. As you bring the heel forward, think of bringing the sit bone back. And then we're going to lengthen the leg away, opening the front of the thigh, pulling the stomach in. Let's do it once more. That's slow. Heel wants to go forward, hip wants to go back. Reach the leg, stretch it out, out, out. And just take a stretch, bend the knee, hold on to the ankle. Open the chest and breathe.
bring the legs together, stretch over for a mermaid, and then bring ourselves up to a kneeling position, stretching up, going to place the left hand on the floor, stretch the arm and just stay there and really lengthen, coming up, stretch to the other side, then we're going to do the side kick kneeling. So the top arm is going to reach up, open the chest, lift the leg and two kicks forwards. Kick, kick, stretch the leg back. Kick, kick, stretch back. Twice more. Kick, kick, stretch back. Kick, kick, stretch, stay back. Again, bend the knee, open the chest. Place both knees on the floor. Let's take a stretch for the right side of the body. And do all that onto the other side. So come to lying on your side. Reach the top leg away, lengthening the stomach, lengthening the back, and slowly heel forward, sits bones back and reach, really lengthen. Again, heel forward, hip back. Reach the leg, see how long you can make the leg, how much you can draw the navel towards the spine, and then bend, and we're gonna take the stretch. Stretch over. Now let's come up. Reach the leg and all the way over. Open the chest. Up and over to the other side. Side kick kneeling. So reach the top hand up, open the chest, lift the leg and kick, kick. Stretching it back. Kick, kick, stretch it back, really open twice more. Kick, kick, and stretch, kick, kick. Take the leg back, bend the knee, hold onto the ankle, open the chest. And then stretch the left side of the body. Come on to our forearms for a forearm arm plank. Press the forearms down, stretch the legs back, lift the stomach. I'm just going to stay there for a moment. And play with taking your heels to the right and to the left. So come back to centre, drop the hips down, and we're in a sphinx pose, pressing the forearms into the mat, opening the chest, really lengthening the spine. It's going to take a few seconds to create more and more and more length through the spine. Coming down, hands underneath the shoulders, press the hands into the mat, keep pressing down, keep lengthening the spine, gaze forwards and bend the elbows back, lengthen, coming forwards. Twice more. Press the hands down, lengthen. Coming up as far as feels good for your back. And bending the elbows. And down. Let's just take it one more time. Pressing down, opening the chest. Coming back down. Reach your arms to the side. Lift up the legs. We're just going to hover and lengthen. Take the right hand forward, left hand back, and side bend. And to the other side. Let's do one more time either side, like a big aeroplane. And relax the arms down. Coming back up. I'm just going to rock a little bit from the right to the left. Really like a big aeroplane. 
press the hands into the floor and let's come back to a rest position. Stay there for a moment. Breathing into the back. Let's come on to all fours. Reach the right hand forward, the left leg back and open them to the side and bring them back to center. So finding the center line, coming away from it and bringing everything back. One more time, open, bring it back and let's do that to the other side. So first find the center line, reach the arm and leg away from each other as they open and back. Open, finding the midline. One more time. Back. Let's tuck the toes under. Reach the hips up so that we're back in a pyramid. Sweep the right leg up. Open the hips and bend the knees. Bend the right knee up to the sky. Come back, rounding the spine. Let's place the right foot forward in a lunge. Really connect the feet down into the floor. Come up with the arms towards the ceiling. Just bend both knees. So you're thinking of the left knee dropping down. And up. One more time. Come forwards. Stretch the front leg. And we'll do the whole thing on the other side. Reaching the left leg up, open the hip, bending the knee, lift the knee up as much as you can. Coming forwards, rounding the back. Place the left foot on the floor, press the feet into the floor to come up to a lunge. Reach the arms up, bend the knees. Coming back to pyramid. Let's come to a push-up position. Feel free to place your knees on the floor and we're going to take five push-ups, taking the arms back, the elbows back and straight. So as the elbows reach back, reach the top of your head forward. Three, two more, four. Last one, come to lying on your stomach. Reach the right hand forwards. Left hand stays where it is. Press both hands into the floor. Rotate, looking over your left shoulder. And coming back. Twice more, lengthen. Rotate, look over the left shoulder. One more time on this side. Let's change sides. Left hand forwards, right hand underneath your shoulder. First lengthen, then press the hands into the floor. Rotate over your right shoulder, looking over your right shoulder. And down. Just twice more. Press down, lengthen up. One last time. Last time, press both hands, open the chest and coming back to a rest position. Let's come back to lying on our backs. Open the arms to the side, take the legs up to 90, 90 degree angle. Let's start with side to side to the right and centering the knees from the deep work of the stomach and going to the left and using the stomach to bring it back. One more time to the right and center and to the left and center. Let's stretch the legs up and we'll do the same thing with long legs. And 
and up and left. One more time either side. Left. And then we're going to bend the knees as the knees go all the way to the floor. Open the chest. Take a deep breath in and release all the air out. And to the other side, let the knees drop all the way to the floor, to the left. <sighs> and you're releasing and relaxing. Deep breath in and out. And then just for a moment, let's come to lying on our backs. Take a deep breath in, filling the body with new air. And exhale all the old air out of the body. One more deep breath in. And relax. Thank you for doing this class with me. And please subscribe if you'd like to do some more free classes.